Good evening, crisp lifers. Welcome to your review for today. What we've got here is a packet of discos. These are a classic playground crisp that I used to eat when I was, well, just a little bit younger. And yeah, they're sort of they're sort of cheap and cheerful, and they're the kind of crisps that you'd kind of give that that girl you fancied um, in the hope of getting a kiss on the cheek. Never worked for me, but that's how I felt about them at the time. Fond memories. This is a multi-pack. We've got cheese and onion, salt and vinegar, and prawn cocktail. Let's do cheese and onion versus salt and vinegar versus prawn cocktail. So there they are. We've got cheese and onion, we've got salt and vinegar, we've got prawn cocktail, and, we, we, and we've got Tigger. Come on, Tigger. Don't you want them? Yeah, Tigger's excited. Well, let's open the bags and see what they're like. So we're going to start with the cheese and onion. Let's dive in there. Get a couple of these out. Oop. There we are. As you can see, they're a sort of disc shaped crisp. This is like a sort of precursor to a Pringle made from formed potato without that classic Pringle shape, but nevertheless quite a nice kind of disc shape there. So disco, I think is referring to the shape, not the discotheque you'd like to ask that girl to. Anyway, let's dive in, see what these are like. Okay, interesting. Mmm, well, that's the cheese and onion. Just gonna just pop that there. Now I'm gonna try a salt and vinegar one. Yeah, oh, I can't get it out. And there we go, discos. There's a salt and vinegar one. Mmm, okay. Just put that down there. And finally, prawn cocktail. I like a prawn cocktail crisp. Let's see what these are like. Mmm. Okay. Pop that there. So, there they are. Um, what do I think? Well, they're kind of hard. They're not particularly crunchy, just a little bit hard. Like they're really compact down, like a really sort of compacted hula hoop. And give that a three out of five. The potato taste is if I'm honest, it's a bit disappointing. Um, I'm going to give the taste a 2 out of 5. It's just not doing it for me. Quite bland. Flavour-wise, the cheese and onion, really like that. That's a great flavour. Uh, I wasn't feeling the salt and vinegar. It just tasted like the hula hoop salt and vinegar. Um, I think I'd rather eat hula hoops. Bit disappointed with that. Prawn cocktail, not bad. Not the best prawn cocktail I've ever had, but not bad. I'm going to give the cheese and onion a four out of five for flavour. The salt and vinegar a two out of five. And the prawn cocktail a three out of five. Munchability, they are a little bit dry, not particularly oily. I could probably get through two or three packets of these, but I don't think I could get through the entire multi-pack. So I'm going to say that this is a three out of five for munchability. Value-wise, pretty good. Six bags of these, I paid one pound. That's great value, especially with today's economic climate. Overall, I'm going to give Discos a three out of five because they're meh, just a bit meh if i had to pick a favorite i would of course pick cheese and onion but most importantly what does tigger pick well looks like tigger was feeling a little bit too shy didn't want to pick his favorite so i'm going to assume that he likes all of them not a bad crisp discos, just nothing special. Overall, a three out of five, but good to have some variety and think about those playground memories. See you next time, folks.